welcome back to my channel welcome to this beautiful channel if you are new to my channel you are highly highly welcome please relax and remember to subscribe just smash that red button down there that says subscribe and click on that red button and that says subscribe and after that click on the bell icon beside it turn on your bell notification so you'll be notified anytime i drop any new video yes if you're a returning subscriber, you are highly, highly welcome. Hey, hey, my people, my people. I so much love you guys. You guys are my G, you guys are my B, you guys are my backbones, you guys are my, you know, mm. I don't joke with you guys, okay? Thank you guys for always supporting me. Thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you guys for dropping your comments, even the good ones and the bad ones. Oh, hey. Thank you guys. God bless you guys. And I pray that whatever you lay your hand, that the good Lord will prosper it, will make it to be successful. Um, I pray that, you know, this year you count millions, okay? More money inside our pockets and bank accounts. So guys, thank you guys. Um, without wasting much of your time, let's dive into the video for today. Yes, the business of the day. So guys, before you start watching this video, please remember to like this video. I beg you, like share comment okay do all that good stuff now and um, there is this video i want to bring to you guys so there is this lady a korean lady um called lily petals she's divorced um she's married she was married to her husband james but she's divorced now eh? they are divorced now yes so a um, couple of weeks ago, I started seeing reaction videos about them, about Lily Petals and James, her husband, um, reaction videos about their divorce. Um, some people insinuated um, things that they think that might be the reason why she divorced her husband. So said that it's because um, James wants to go back to Kenya. And to some people, it's because James is a Kenyan man. Why this uh, Lily Petal? She's a Korean woman, you know, that kind of thing, maybe kind of racist and that kind of stuff. Um, after watching some of their videos, it did not sit well with me. Um, personally, I'm not someone that would jump into reaction videos because everyone is doing reaction videos. I like doing reaction videos because I know what to say and um, I want to talk about that. So I don't know them. Period before then, I don't used to watch them. I don't used to watch Lily Petta. So I decided to go to her channel to make a research about her. Um, I watched a couple of her videos. Um, I even watched um, her divorce announcement video where she announced that she's divorced to James. She's no longer married to James. But their divorce is like a kind of, will I say, a kind of open marriage now because they are still together. But according to her, they are still together for the kids, you know, for the betterment of the kids. She don't want to separate the kids from their father. Do you get? And that is one point. I'm still coming back to that later on in this video because that's where i'm picking my point so she don't want her husband um her husband to be very far from the kids like she still want that bond her kids to bond with their dad you get mm -hmm. so that is why it did not sit well with me most of the reaction videos because um if I, i'm divorcing my husband because of racist um i don't think i will still want him to be close to my kids okay i will try to make the kids to follow suit you understand now, after I watched a couple of her videos, I found out that she never announced reason why she divorced her husband or reason why the thing occurred. Um, I started watching all that. I said, you know, digging deeper. Yes, you can call me Ami, but no problem. <laughs> I've told you guys that this channel is Ami, but channel. Her all reaction now. What else do you expect? <laughs> I started watching uh, other videos. So I stumbled upon these particular videos where she was a kind of saying that her marriage is in crisis. Um, according to her in that video, her husband, her then husband, um, James, bought a bike. So when James came back, she asked him, um, how much did you buy the back, bike? But according to her, before then, it's like James already had one bike. So after buying the second one, he came back and she asked him, how much did you buy the bike? And James responded to her that he bought it um, zero dollars. You get zero dollars. That means 
he did not buy it, they did not sell it to him, kind of they dashed him or you know, maybe he plucked it from the bike tree. <laughs> maybe there is a tree that used to, you know, produce bike. So the girl was pissed off, um, but before then, before she asked um, James, before everything, James never knew that she, you know, plotted a kind of spy camera to spy James. She was spying her husband, which um, I'll still bring up, talk about in this video. She was spying her husband to know, you know, things that is going on around her, around him, sorry, um, where he goes, what he does, what he used to do, that kind of stuff. Um, so she has already, she had already listened to his conversation with the buyer, with the seller, someone that sold the bike to him. So she has already listened to the conversation and she already knew um, how much he bought the bike. So it's the kind of the husband came back and started, you know, lying or something like that. Let me just put it like that. So she was pissed off. So personally, um, what am I trying to do? So later on, later on, there's this video she dropped yesterday. Yeah, yesterday or day before yesterday, I watched that video and that's what I want to, why I want to make this video, I'm making this video ready set. It's because um, she did not say any reason why they divorced. She is yet to say that. If actually she will still say that, I don't know. Um, but from what she said, because that video, she, she titled it, Why She Divorced the Husband, Why the Divorce Happened. Um, she said, according to her, and I said, and I quote, that maybe she was not the right person for James, for her husband, for her then husband, okay? Or probably, maybe the man was not the right person, right husband for her. So, um, that was all she said, okay? That was the only reason she gave why they are no longer together, they um, are no longer married, but they are still in the same house. Um, so what, 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 what am I making? Why am I making this video? What am I saying in this video? What is the point I'm trying to bring out? Point I'm trying to bring out is that um, people should, you know, always get the right information before they make videos. Okay, this lady never said reason. Um, bringing out, bringing in resisting here is like you know crashing heads together it's like when koreans watch this video they will be against the kenyans when kenyans watch this video they'll be against the, which you know is not right eh? and that wasn't the reason why they divorced okay let love lead and there's another thing i want to bring out here if that lady is like the way people used to portray her or some people said um in their reaction videos if she was like that or she's like that I don't think she will want her kids to be close to their dad. She wants the kids to feel the presence of the dad. She wants the dad, the, the husband, like the, the father of her kids, to still, you know, be there in the life of her kids. You get? And for me, that's to that for me, for her. You get? Like, that made me to love her. Because especially some ladies here, especially ladies, some ladies will divorce their husband. They would like to, you know, Bad mouth him, tell the kids all the things, whether the ones that happen and the ones that not happen. They would like to make the kids to start disliking their dad um, because she's no longer married to the husband. They would not even like the kids to go closer to the husband. So personally, um, I think that we should go by her own words that maybe they are not good for each other, they are not good to be husband and wife, maybe they are good in other aspects, but they are not good for each other. And um, personally, I will not blame her and I will not blame her husband because the truth is that um, for her to, you know, install a spy camera, that means there is always, that there is already fishy stuff going on, something fishy is going on, was going on before she, you know, installed that camera. And um, that means the trust is no longer there or uh, the trust was no longer there for her to, you know, install that camera. Do you get so personally, I don't think that there's any reason for, you know, disliking her, calling her names like so many people reacted about their, um, reacted in, on their videos and call her names. So personally, I think we should respect them. Um, 
Um, so another thing I want to say here is that um, I think we should respect them. And in marriage, I'm not trying to blame the man, but in marriage, no need of, you know, keeping secrets, no need of lying. I'm not saying that that's the reason why they, you know, they're no longer together, but it must contribute, I'm very sure. Because, you know, these people, there are some people that don't relate lies. You get, so you can't buy a bike and you are lying to your wife that you did not buy a bike or you did not pay for it. So this is my own opinion, okay? Mm -hmm. And before then, I think they, are, they already had a kind of joint account where they, you know, put money together, maybe save money together for the upkeep of the family. And you went there, spend the money. She went there and traced it and found out that how much you, you bought the bike. Check her spy camera and saw that you were still lying to her. So personally, I think that um, in marriage, some people don't understand meaning of marriage before going to it. Marriage is a kind of a place you should be transparent, you get. And I'm going to end this video here with this. Um, leave your comment down in the comment section. Remember to like, comment and share. And with this, I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.